Hey guys, it's Jeremy, the math person. Today I'll be going over question 22 on SO exam P. So pause the video quick and try this problem yourself. Okay, as soon as you're tinted, let's just dive right in. So at the beginning of the study, 20% were classified as a heavy smoker, 30% as light smokers, and 50% as non smokers. So the first sentence says the probability that light smokers die, so death given light smoker, is twice as likely as the probability of death given non-smokers sometimes if i get confused about is this right or not i just like think to myself like what's more likely to happen low risk people dying or non non-smokers dying well that we know that light light smoker is going to die more has a higher probability of dying so then i just assign like a random thing for like um normal people so if the death given not normal people is let's say like one fourth then the probability of death given low risk is equal to two times one four and we know that the one half is definitely greater than one fourth, so we know that this statement is true. So, like sometimes if I'm not 100% sure, I like to do that little mini check. And then, then the probability of dead given low risk is one half as likely as heavy risk. So, dead given heavy, heavy smokers. All right, and we're asked to find the probability that the participant was a heavy smoker given that they died. <laughs> So this is equal to by the law by the conditional probability formula this is the probability of h given d divided by the probability of d and by the law of total probability we can break in base theorem we can break this down into the probability that they were dead given high heavy smoker times the probability that they were heavy smoker and the denominator we just have to sum it up so probability of dead given high times the probability of high plus the probability that they died given they were light smoker times the probability that they were light smoker times the probability that they were they died given they were non-smoker times the probability that they were non-smoker i'm going to put everything in terms of l because we everything has an l in it or low risk in it so this we can say the probability we can also let's say is the probability that they were died given they were high risk is equal to twice the likelihood right and uh, we can also rephrase this probability that they died given they were normal is equal to one half the probability that they died given they were light smokers all right so let's stop put it in here i'm going to put two times probability that they died given they were low risk times the probability of h which is here, 0.2 divided by the probability that they, so same thing here, 2 times P D given L times 0.2 plus D given L, that's already in terms of D and L, D given L times the probability of L, that's 0.3. And lastly, right here, probability of D given N, D given N is 1 half, 1 half times the probability of d given l times the probability of normal that's 0.5 so i can actually factor out the p probability of d given l outside and you get on the top and the denominator right so you get 2 times 0.2 that's 0.4 divided by 0.4 plus 0.3 plus 1 fourth 0.4 divided by 0.95 approximately equal to 0.421 which is our answer d if you guys have any questions feel free to leave them down below otherwise as always make sure you like subscribe and share bye